Uh, some of you have some uh, thoughts about the dyno uh, that I have built here for the uh, small two-stroke engines. And I will show you now the basic facts of this thing. What we have here is an engine. We have a chain transmission for sprocket gear. And in that sprocket gear, we have a rev counter that counts the um, uh, sprocket teeth. And also we have this shaft, which is connected to the hydraulic pump. The hydraulic pump takes oil from, from the floor in an oil tank. I have an, uh, an extra manometer here, which I can uh, see the uh, pressure building up. This is a very small pump. It's only for uh, 25 cubic centimeters per revolution. And uh, I would go to upgrade it now later on here for 50 uh, cubic centimeter per revolution pump. Uh, the pressure is uh, uh, nominated at 160 and maximum pressure is 200 bar on this one. Uh, when I drive the uh, uh, when I drive the uh, engines, I have uh, the outlet of the hydraulic pump here, which is connected to this valve, which I can adjust here. When I adjust it, uh, the things that happen then is that the uh, the pump wants to start to move because it's it's uh, in a bearing on the other side here. And when it starts to move, force the pressure. I have this uh, pressure sensor here that is connected to the computer. And the pressure sensor sends the uh, signal to the computer down here. So if I just press it a little bit here, you can see the engine torque is, op is uh, starting to um, go up. And also, this is a bit overkill. I have this um, uh, broadband lambda sensor from Bosch here, uh, so I can see the um, perfect uh, uh, the perfect uh, amount of uh, fuel uh, fuel and air air fuel ratio. That's the that's the word I was looking for. Uh, the uh, computer system it's from a company in Iceland Baldur's control system and uh, what I have here is I have a, um, a voltage uh, service you can call it whatever you want and I have this um, uh, on, on the, uh, in the in the program here I have a lot of things I can do the dyno calibration for example uh, when I when I can see how many teeth I have here, I have twenty six teeth. It's twenty six teeth on uh, this uh, one here. So actually, what what we need to calculate the how horsepower is, uh, we need to know the speed of the drive shaft to the um, hydraulic pump, and we need to know the force, and uh, with that we can calculate how much. Um, newton meters or horsepower uh, we have and I get it out here on the screen also uh, the power the the logging it's it's uh, I can open a log file we can take a log file here for example uh, one that I have been driven not so not so long ago maybe here here I have something it's a, um, I don't know what engine it is, 5.5 .5 horsepower. I think it's uh, one of the uh, SUX engine. And when I see this, I can see the horsepower, 5.5 .5 maximum. At this moment, it's 417. What speed? It's uh, 9,861 RPM. And the engine torque is then uh, just 3 Newton. The brake torque on the, uh, on the pump is... 32 new newton so here i can 
here I can see where where do I have maximum torque it's there there is maximum torque maximum torque actually is at 9049 rpm and uh, then we have 5.33 37 horsepower <laughs> That's the way it works. I should start it up and um, show you how the uh, lambda works. I think you know how the lambda works, but here when it's running, it's uh, 30 to 1. here and I can uh, look at the log file uh, this time I didn't have any uh, possibility to uh, push maximum because I hold the telephone also but we, what we can see here is that the the uh, the engine produced 3.87 horsepower here at 6400 rpm and the torque was uh, 4.36 newton here basically that's uh, that's the way it works and uh, yeah if you have any question don't hesitate to contact me i also get uh, questions why there is a light bulb here uh, that's because when i take out the uh, speed on the engine rotation I take it from one of the light coils here and um, since the power is uh, <laughs> Wechselstrom, you know, uh, I need to have this uh, light bulb to uh, get the uh, signal a little bit damped because you can see here it's a little bit uh, like up and down like this. Uh, and uh, if I didn't have the uh, light bulb, it would go t -t 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 bananas like that. So that's why I have this uh, light bulb here. <laughs>